Hello and Assalamu alaikum and we are going to make Greek moussaka today. Well, if you think about Greek moussaka, a lot of people say it's quite rich and you know, like it has a lot of calories uh, because it has white sauce and cheese. But if you just think about it, that if you're having a square piece out of it, it's not that big of an amount. So you can have it and it's really healthy because there are a lot of vegetables and um, you know, meat. So your protein, your good carbs are there. If there's a little bit of cheese, you can decide like how much butter or uh, flour or alternative, um, you know, things that you want to use in order to make it more healthier. So let's start and uh, start assembling our vegetables first. So here I have some olive oil um, that I am going to lay down in my baking dish around a teaspoon just to grease it. You are going to layer your aubergines or if you want to slow cook it then do 35 minutes at 150-160. On top of this I am going to add some sliced red onions. So these are three sliced red onions. All these vegetables will go soft, they wilt really nicely. Um, and then we are also going to add potatoes but that's at a later stage because my potatoes are already boiled uh, so it's I'm not gonna otherwise the first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna layer your potatoes at the bottom because it takes a lot of time to cook then these are uh, your courgettes or zucchini around three of them and these are some mixed herbs so put a generous amount of mixed herbs so then we are going to add pepper lastly we are going to add some salt drizzle some olive oil so now we are going to uh, prepare our minced chicken ideally people like to use beef but because of cholesterol i'm trying to consume a lot of white meat these days so here i have um, olive oil uh, then we have garlic whole pot of garlic uh, then we have some anoto seeds here but that's not part of the recipe if you want to use it i love it that's why i'm using it for the depth that's cumin powder uh, there we have uh, cinnamon powder ginger garlic paste crushed red chilies salt ginger garlic powder black pepper and yeah that's about it now after roasting it for 2-3 minutes, I am going to add minced chicken. Add a teaspoon of tomato puree or paste. I am adding some smoky tomato sauce. This is not part of the recipe but I just like the flavor so that's why I am adding it. So for the sauce, I am just having some coriander. Then add four tomatoes, small medium sized tomatoes. I am going to add some marinated sun dried peppers around a tablespoon. So there we have two peppers and they are marinated in olive oil. We are also going to add some sun dried tomatoes. I am going to start blending this after adding the sun dried tomatoes. So now our sauce is nicely blended, it's thick because of the uh, sun-dried tomatoes and peppers. We are going to add it in our minced chicken. And now mix it well. So there we have our vegetables. As you can see, it's nicely wilted and the quantum is reduced as well. So that's here. My you know chicken is ready and i'm going to start layering it on top of these vegetables and at the end i'm going to add potatoes and the white sauce so as you can see i've laid uh, my chicken on top of the vegetables and i'm layering my potatoes 
and then I'm going to add white sauce. I'm not going to tell you the recipe of white sauce over here. I will make it separately for you, but it's simple white sauce that you have to make. So now after adding potatoes and white sauce, I just sprinkled some mixed herbs and pepper. On top of it, I am going to layer some fresh mozzarella. And then we are going to layer some cheddar cheese. Now this is going in the oven for one hour at 150 degrees centigrade. 